Hey guys, so it's been a really long time since I've filmed a video and so much has happened, so much has been going on in my life and um, I've had a lot of people tell me they miss my videos, they want me to start recording again and quite frankly I had gotten busy and whatnot and I had been going through a whole lot of stuff which we'll talk about since I'm open and honest with you guys. So this might be a long video but this is why I've been gone. And this is what you can expect now from my channel. Okay, I'm using my laptop right now because it is fixed again. Um, I, I don't know if you remember, like, the older videos, it was, like, slowing down and, like, having this delay. So when I would record, it would be hard for me to, like, do swatches because it was delaying it for me. It's not doing that anymore. So we're good. But back in October, uh, October 26th of 2016, Ian and Tyrone broke up after four and a half years. Um, we just kind of part ways. Things just weren't going the way I wanted. Um, we wanted different things. I wanted to eventually get married again, you know, even though my first marriage, let me try to fix you guys, sorry. Even though my first marriage didn't go like according to plan and it sucked and it was awful. You know, I wanted to give the marriage thing another try. At first, when me and him got together, um, he did propose in the first six months, and then, like, some of his family members gave him some shit about it, and so kind of retracted that. So we just stayed together, and at first, yes, he wanted kids, and then as we went on over the next four and a half years, he didn't want kids anymore. So, you know, and I already have a son from my first marriage. So it was just things that, I wanted something different than what he wanted. And, um, you know, he's doing really well on his own right now. We still talk. We're still friends. Um, we'll always be friends. We'll always be there for each other. We went through a lot together in four and a half years. He was there for me through a lot. I was there for him through a lot. And he will always be a really good friend of mine. But I will always have love for him. Um, I'm not going to say anything bad about him because there, there just really isn't anything. It's just we wanted different things in life. And he, at this moment, like, you know, doesn't even want a relationship. I do. You know, I want to be in a relationship. I want to um, find that man where I can get married and have a family and, you know, all of that. So it was just, um, that was kind of a hard time for me. And then I had started dating a guy. I dated him for only a couple of weeks. Um, and he turned out, I tried dating an older man. He lied to me about his age. First of all, he, I'm 28. He said he, when I met him, and I know online dating, some people are against it, some people are for it, whatever. That's how I met Tyrone, and that was four and a half years of a pretty good relationship, so whatever it is, it is what it is. But this guy said he was like 32, and I'm like, okay, 28, 32, that's not too bad. Then it came out he was 38, and he couldn't change the age on his profile. And I'm like, okay. And then later I found out he had a son that was like 18, or 19 and I'm like whoa turned out he was 43 and he was a fuck boy and that was the first time I'd ever come across a fuck boy and I didn't even like really I, I had heard the name but I didn't really know what the hell that was I'm like okay so bye like all he wanted to do was drink party didn't have a car he worked but he never had any money um I was spending money and I'm like cool no bye so after like two or three weeks I was like whatever. So then I met um, this other guy who I dated for five months and he ran a scam on me pretty much. Like he had a girlfriend and they were together for like two years. She pretended to be his best friend. She talked to me, pretended to be my best friend and they were actually dating and at one point living together. And she um, let him continue to date me for so long because she thought I was just giving him money and I wasn't. Like, we were in an actual relationship. So, and then he had a side chick on top of that. And he was, like, cheating, if you will, on me with a bunch of other girls. So that went on uh, until May of this year. Like, May 9th, I broke it off. And then when I broke up with him, because he had been continuously lying to me about everything, he made a porn website of me, put my name, my phone number, my address. He put porn of me all over Facebook. And that was, like, one of the worst things I had ever experienced from a guy. Like, I'm like, how are you going to be mad at me for breaking up with you because you're with other people? 
and then you're lying to me about it, but then they're sending me screenshots, and I had several girls over five months constantly messaging me on Facebook, constantly like, you do realize I'm sleeping with him too, you do realize this, you do realize that, you do realize, and I'm just like, I'm good. So I left him. So right now, like, I'm just kind of doing my own thing. Um, you know, I am talking to, um, you know, somebody and I'm at a relationship right now. See where it goes, see what happens, update you guys that, you know, on that later. Um, and I don't know if you've noticed, if you've watched any of my previous videos and you look at me now, um, back in October, I was 290 pounds. I have lost 80 pounds. And I know you can tell in my face. Um, my body, you can definitely tell as well if you were to see body shots, but I don't actually have a, like, a full length mirror, so I actually don't ever take body shots, like pictures, because I don't have a way to do that, unless I go to somebody's house and do it, which I might. So there's another thing, I changed how I have been eating. I was really, my cholesterol was really high, and that was one of the reasons my dad had passed away, and, um, today is. July 18th, tomorrow is his death anniversary, but um, his cholesterol was over 800 and mine was at like 410, so I'm like, I'm halfway to where he was when he died, and my grandfather pointed out, honey, you can have a heart attack at 400, so you need to get this under control, so I stopped eating meat, I stopped eating carbs, carbs hold water weight, um, so you'll lose that instantly, I do fruits and vegetables, um, I'll sometimes buy, like, the fake meats from, like, Morningstar and whatnot. Um, I take my vitamins. Um, I'll do, like, little workout exercises, like planks and squats and stuff in my room. Um, and stuff like that. So I'm trying to get healthier, drink a lot more water. Every once in a while I'll have, you know, something that's not water, but not a lot of sugar because I'm not even, like, sugar, um, tastes funny to me now that I've cut it out of my, you know, routine. So I'll drink like unsweetened tea and, you know, stuff like that. So I do have a shit ton of videos for you guys. I did have Ipsy started back up. So I have June and July that I will make videos for. I will put those in the same video just to save video. Um, when I was with the guy who was a, a fuck boy, he actually destroyed my phone because he thinks he's a technician and like all this IT bullshit. And it trashed my phone. I ended up having to get a new phone just recently um, because finally my phone just quit. He completely destroyed my computer. Like, he took my hard drive out, hooked it up to my desktop, and then my laptop was destroyed. And Tyrone did fix it for me. So this is all working well. I still have my HD cameras, and I will use those to film. But, like, today I'm just a lazy bitch. I'm sorry. I'm just going to be straight up. Like, I slapped on one color of eyeshadow, mascara, and some lip stuff because I was too lazy to do my makeup. But I wanted to start filming because these videos are really, really piling up. I have so much good stuff for you guys. Um, if you remember my best friend in Louisiana, Alicia, who's at Rhapsody here on um, YouTube. We've talked, you know, I've, I've told you about her. She's put me in her videos. I've put her in my videos. I can link her down below if you would like. She started her own makeup company. I have a huge review and a giveaway to do, but I want to, um, I'm not going to do that today because I have to set up the giveaway. I have a bunch of stuff I want to put into it and I need to get that sorted out. And I also want to do a full face of makeup with her products um, to show you what they look like when I do that video. That way you can see her products on my face. And right now it's that time of the month. I don't know if you can tell, but my entire chin broke out overnight last night. And I was like, oh, goody, this should be fun. So I literally am just bare minimum today. No foundation, no nothing. Also, my skin's kind of been changing um, with losing uh, as much weight as I have been. In seven months, I've lost 80 pounds. Um, and that messes with your hormones because fat stores hormones. So when you lose a lot of weight really quickly, it will mess up your hormones. It can mess up your cycle, can mess with your skin. Plus when it's that time of month, your hormones are messed up again. So, um, I did go to Sephora yesterday. Um, I didn't purchase anything, but I did get a lot of samples and stuff. And, um, I had them recolor match me. 
and see what they could do for me like foundation wise and what we can try for my skin. So I have a couple different foundation samples that we're going to try out. Um, but I will show you that in a video in a little bit. Um, I have a BH cosmetic call. Now some of this stuff is a couple months. It's been a couple months. Um, I do have, I know a lot of people do the makeup I've used up over the year. I'm doing makeup that I've used up over six months because I also do, um, you know, products that I've used up. So I've separated the two. So I've, I've got my basket here full of like regular products that I've used up on a regular like basis, like deodorants, shampoos, um, skincare, you know, that kind of stuff. And then I have my cute little like, it's a little pink trash can that is literally just for makeup and stuff that I've used up that I keep, um, that I got for a dollar at the Dollar Tree, um, so that I can do this. And it's like already half full and that's six months. So I'll try to do this every six months. So probably January or February, you'll get another video. And then, you know, as my basket fills up with my regular trash, if you want to call it, products I've used up video, um, I'll just keep redoing it for you guys. Um, I have a BH Cosmetics haul. Um, I have two Ipsy bags. I have a thing, a basket of products that I'm currently trying to use up. So it's like, these products I'm trying, like, I have a lot. Like, I have so much makeup you guys just don't even understand. I'm swimming in it, and I love it, and that's fine. But I do have this basket of stuff that I am trying to use up before the end of the year. And or, and it also has stuff that I use, like, on a daily basis, like my primers and whatever. So I will show you that as well. Um, and then I have another indie company that I had bought from. She's new. Um, and I will link her below when I do her video. Um, and she's actually got some pretty good stuff and she's really reasonably priced. So I do enjoy that. Alicia will always be my favorite though. I'm biased. She's like my best friend and I love her and I'm so proud of her for starting up her company. Alicia, I love you and I know you're watching this video because you've been asking me to make videos again. So I know you're watching. Your video is coming up in like the next week. I promise you. Let my breakouts go away. And I love you dearly. Um, but I also have a huge wish haul. And this wish haul is like months. Like it's stuff I've collected over months. And every time I get it, I will put it in a basket. If I use something out of it, I'll still put it right back in the basket. So that I have it there for you to um, show in the video. Um, if you notice my nails, yes, I did my nails today. Yes, I did them myself. And yes, most of this is off of Wish. So it cost me less than $3 to do this. They're beautiful. They're thermal. They change four different colors. And we will talk about that when I do the Wish video. Um, let's see what else has been happening in my life. Um, I started to do newspapers again back in December. So that also does take up a lot of my time. I do need you guys to understand that. So I can't promise here's a video every week, here's a video every two weeks, here's three videos a week. I work midnight every single night and I am doing that. Um, so I'll make a video on that. I have a lot of things I want to talk about on my Let's Talk series. So we're going to be doing that. Um, I would like to do an updated domestic violence one because there has been so much crap happening with my husband that... Um, I would like to talk to you guys about that and you guys, you know, cause this is real. I'm real with you and honest with you, you know my life and I have no problem with that. So, um, you know, anything like that. And if you're an, an indie company and you're watching this and you would like me to, um, review any of your products and do a video on them and show them, please feel free to contact me at any point in time. You can contact me in here. I will also leave an email address down below and you can email me at any point in time um, because I love trying new indie companies um, even if I have to buy the product you know I don't mind you don't have to send it to me for free but if you would like me to feature your company on my channel because I'm such a supporter of indie companies then we can talk about you know I can do that and we can talk and you know whatnot um, so basically there's been a lot going on um, I don't have internet anymore, 
So I'm going to try to hotspot off my phone and see if I can upload videos. Now the problem with my computer being redone, I don't have the software to edit my videos the same one I was using before. So I either have to find one that's already on my computer when Tyrone reset it and if, figure out how to use it. And if I can't, I need to find another one. I also might have to like go to the library a couple times a week and use their Wi-Fi to upload videos if my hotspot is not strong enough or it just takes way too long or whatever. So I'm going to try my hardest to do this the best I can. But with being on my own, being a single mom, not getting any type of support, my job um, is just barely paying the bills at this point. I'm going to be straight up with you. Um, I can't afford internet right now. I wish I could and I wish I could make this faster. But I might not be able to even edit videos. So a video would go up and they're not edited and I don't have a cute song and I don't have a cute intro and I don't have whatever. Bear with me. I will eventually. I will try my hardest to get that going. But right now I just want to get this channel up and going again and I want things to, you know, get going again. And I will be doing decluttering soon. I did just declutter a shit ton of makeup to my friend for the Pride Parade. Because she was like, hey, Erica, do you have any rainbow makeup? Do you have any rainbow palettes? And I was like, girl, let's go. I sent her a huge tote full of, like, rainbow shit, glitter, like, everything. Like, so I did just declutter. So it might be a little bit before I declutter again. And I have sometimes have a hard time with decluttering because then I go back and I change it. And I'm like, no, I'll use it. I'm going to keep it. And then I don't use it. So we'll see how this goes. Um. So this has kind of like been what my life has been. This has kind of been like what's happening. Um, there's been a lot of problems with Nick since the beginning of the year. He's been in and out of the mental hospital. He's seven now. He does have a lot of problems. Um, we'll also do a Let's Talk video about that because um, I don't know if I told you guys before. He has autism, but he has two forms of it. He has ASD and Asperger's. He has something now called BMDD, which is a mood disorder, bipolar um, severe anger issues, and he's got, like, some others, um, the ADHD, like, just, you know, some stuff that's going on, and things that go crazy in my life, and so we will talk about that in Let's Talk. I will keep Let's Talk going, and I have so much that I want to talk to you guys about that, but I figured I would make this, and I probably won't edit this. It'll probably just go straight up before any, excuse me, before any of the other videos, and then you guys can um, kind of just see what's been going on. There's been so much more going on in my life than I can even fit. This is already over 17 minutes long. Um, so I think I'm going to break some of that down into the Let's Talk videos. So um, I'm really excited to have my channel going again. And I know a lot of you are too. There will be a giveaway after Alicia's video. And so I really want you to stay tuned for that because it's going to be pretty cool. She did make a custom lip balm for me, and that will be one of the items I'm giving away. You cannot get it again. It's limited edition. I named it. I chose the color. I chose the scent. It is literally limited edition customized because I made it. So when it's gone from her website, it's gone. And it, somebody will be getting that in the giveaway. Plus, I have a whole bunch of other stuff. So that's what's been going on. I'm going to end this video so I can start the Ipsy video, and I have missed you guys so much, and I am so excited to start this again. And yes, I know my camera's not perfect on the pixelation, and it's not that great, but um, I might use my camera at some point. My tripod got broken. I have another one that I got off of Wish, but I think it's kind of shady, and I'm not sure how I feel about it. And I did have to get another huge memory card because mine just literally took a shit on me and I lost everything that was on it. So we'll see how it goes. I might keep doing it on the laptop because it's like saved to the laptop and then I can edit on the laptop. We'll see how this goes. You guys can leave comments down below and tell me, do you want me to use my other cameras that I've used in the past? Or do you, want, do you guys not mind this? What do you want to see from me? Um, what videos are you looking for? Um, and just let me know. Okay. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.